Good evening Philippines, this is Mike Padua and we are back to our latest analysis for this Monday, May 9 to uh, May 11, Wednesday. And this is the English version for you by Typhoon 2000. Let's begin with our update. Here is the latest graph set uh, for this Monday to Tuesday. Tomorrow, May 10, we have the easterly surface wind flow. Still affecting the Bicol region, Mimaropa, Metro Manila, Calabar Zone. Eastern Luzon, extreme northern Luzon, including Batanes, Baboy, and Cobra Island. So these areas will have uh, busy conditions blowing from the east. And uh, sunny skies with afternoon or evening rain showers and thunderstorms, particularly over the areas of northern Luzon. While over the Visayas and the whole of Mindanao, it will be uh, rainy conditions expected because of the emergence of the Intertropical convergence zones. This is uh, converging winds from the northeast and southeast. So it creates more thunderstorms over this line of uh, the IDCA. So uh, expect to bring your rain gear umbrellas during the afternoon or evening because of this uh, intertropical convergence zone. So far, there are still no developing low pressure areas or tropical cyclone within the next uh, couple of days. Uh, however, uh, this cloudiness within the ITCA may develop into a shallow LPA within the next couple of days. We are going to observe this based on the uh, computer models, but it is not expected to intensify. Uh, up north over Taiwan and the southern islands of Japan, we have a slow moving frontal system bringing some winds across these areas. And so far, that's the latest from GraphSat. Here's the fast animation. You can clearly see here the cloudiness of the intertropical convergence zone, bringing rainfall across Mindanao, as you can see it here from the uh, zoom in satellite animation from windy.com. Eastern Visayas are being uh, uh, affected by the thunderstorms because of the intertropical convergence zone, while the rest of the archipelago will remain good. Easterly wind flow of the Beagle region. And if we take a look at the rain forecast from the European model, this is from the windy.com uh, website. For the next three days until Thursday, we expect more thunderstorms to occur, uh, especially in the afternoon or evening, across Mindanao and most parts of Visayas, as well as over the uh, mountainous areas of Cordillera and Ilocos region. And on uh, Wednesday afternoon, the effects of the uh, intertropical convergence zone will start to weaken, although some thunderstorms may be still uh, be expected across the uh, western and central sections of Mindanao, including the Sulu Archipelago and uh, smaller areas of uh, Visayas and also with the Bicol region becoming uh, increasing uh, thunderstorms across Ilocos region. And on Wednesday afternoon, Thunderstorms will continue to persist over Mindanao, some portions of the Visayas, and also some portions of Luzon, particularly Ilocos and the Cordillera regions, Central Luzon, including Metro Manila, Calabar Zone, Mindoro, as well as small areas of the Bicol region. So there you go. Here's the rainfall accumulation forecast for the next three days until Thursday, most of the bulk of the rainfall are concentrated across uh, Sulu Archipelago and Mindanao, as well as some portions of uh, Visayas. And uh, here's the wind forecast for the next three days until Thursday. By uh, tomorrow, Tuesday afternoon, the easterlies will uh, prevail across the Bicol region and some portions of eastern and extreme northern Luzon, while over Mindanao, the prevailing uh, intertropical convergence zone. Wednesday afternoon, the easterlies will remain the dominant wind system across the uh, Bisayan area, eastern Luzon, Bicol region, and eastern Mindanao. And also through Thursday, but winds from the south will be expected to occur across the northern sections of Luzon, including Batanes, while east to southeasterly winds will be expected across 
Eastern Visayas, Northeastern Mindanao, and the Bicol region. So there you go. That's the latest for this Monday evening. And we will return on Wednesday to give you more update on the weather. From Typhoon 2000, this is Mike Padua reporting. Stay safe always. Be hashtag weatherwiser. And thank you so much for watching our channel. Good evening to all.